All right, a touching video from 2016, now going viral. This of Molly Tibbetts sharing a personal story about prayer. I got down and I prayed, and I asked God to give me the strength to make it through it, to tell me what to do, to help me out with whatever happened, and to know what his plan was. In that moment, I kind of knew that that was God's way of showing me that the power of prayer was really something. Carla Shimkis with Fox News Headlines 24-7, Sirius XM 115, here with the thoughts and prayers that continue to pour in for the missing Iowa University student. Mm, so yeah. sad, Carla. They sure are, absolutely. Now, Molly Tibbetts aunt posted that video to Facebook. It shows her speaking at a high school faith event where she talks about the time she asked God to give her strength before an important track meet. Uh, she goes on to say that she ran her best time that season, and she attributes her success to the power of prayer. Uh, like you said, Jillian, so many prayers are now pouring in for her on social media. Jenny on Facebook says, I pray she has the same strength today. Exactly every word she can, she said, can apply to her today. God has a plan for her and he is working through her, praying every day. Brandy on Facebook also says, what an amazing message then and now. May God continue to give her strength and courage. And Cheryl also chiming in saying, this shows how amazing this girl is and gave it to God to get her through her run. She and the rest of us need to give it to God that she soon can come home. Uh, so Molly's father believes that she is still alive. The uh, reward for her is now, what, at $300,000? You can't imagine what that family is no, going through. Just unbelievable. Yeah. All right, Rosie's at it again. Yeah, she sure is. Uh, she has a new theory on how President Trump won the 2016 presidential election. It has nothing to do with out, camp out campaigning, rather, Hillary Clinton. Uh, she now says that he owes his presidency to Celebrity Apprentice. Take a listen. I think largely because of the Celebrity Apprentice. I blame Mark Burnett for creating a false narrative around this man. Nobody treated him with respect or dignity until this show came on. All right, well, social media talking about this one. Jessica says, no, it's the Russians. No, it's Comey. No, it's the Apprentice creator. But the popular vote, enjoy second place. Let that sink in till 2025. Okay, and another Twitter user says she certainly has a wild imagination. Of course, these two have been going back and forth for years now. The guy was an icon of American success for 30 years mm -hmm. before The Apprentice. Yeah. But I guess that, that doesn't yeah, count. You know, he's only a billionaire. Yeah. All right. Uh, I guess it's, it's my, your you, you want me to talk about it? All right, yeah. <laughs> it's your turn. I'll just dive right in. That's okay. Yeah, so let's a photo just, just of take a, it away, Carly. Yeah, of I'm an sorry. Alabama. That's okay. A photo of an Alabama deputy uh, posing on his first day of school is going viral online. Uh, this is a picture of Nathan Hendrick posing with a, oh, he's got a Spider-Man lunch box right there. Oh, you can see it right there. <laughs> posing in front of his house. This is before his first day as a school resource officer. So this is getting lots of laughs online. The Shelby County Sheriff's Office posted this to Facebook. Look at his facial expression. He looks rather <laughs> embarrassed. I oh, like that's it. That's funny. That's great. Thank you, Carly. Good.